Hello. Hello and welcome back. To in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing Makina's pink puffer and joggers outfit. It also and it has an embroidered hat. I think the rest of it's in another language. <laughs> and it also comes with little Sue's in a search. But this is what we're going to be reviewing today. And it, we're, you're going to see it on the doll. We're going to... I am going to quickly sift our camera down a little. So here I am. This is what... It, we're opening the box up. This is the front. Gonna, this is the back. I said actually... Uh, so this because this has an interesting back these ones instead of just being like warnings not to swallow it it actually has information so it has stuff about the designer and also information saying like don't let baby swallow anything from here but you know i said so that really you know what's worse than a baby a small object <laughs> So anyway, let's look at the outfit, because I'm pretty hyped about that. Also, if anyone's noticed, I have better lighting and a tripod now. Oh, oh my god. It is so much shinier than I expected. You should see this on camera. It, Whoa. it is something. I don't know if I need to put a warning for people that are sensitive or something for this one. My hiney is so shiny. So here's the puffer jacket. It has a little... This is part of the zipper's plastic with the pull appears. It feels like metal to me. It has a little star on it. It's metal. So that, the pull's metal, but the zipper itself is plastic. I could see you wearing this. This is the interior of the puffer. It's really thick feeling, so I doubt she'll be able to move her arms once it's on here. <laughs> Dummy thick. She has very thick jackets, our girl. So Alright, like let's cold. move on to from the very sparkly photo. Hey, is it? Of this is her little, I'm gonna call it a beanie with an embroidered butterfly that's shiny. Ooh. There's a little tag on the inside. It probably will stretch over her head. Here is a very big, I like this little pink tang top. It's a very neutral color. You could pair this with anything. That's such a great mix and match piece. And these are like velvet sweatpants with real pockets. pockets. That work. Real shiny pockets that work. Work it clean. Ooh. Harlem Fastener outdid themselves, but all the stuff I've seen from them is pretty good, so. You just had, it just took a little bit to grow on me, because I'm not into that much fashion stuff. Um, yeah, the only fashion you're into is in your doll's fashion. You wear sweatpants half the time. Hey, I like what they do for the dolls. Her and Claudia have wonderful collections. I would have her other outfit, but it was sold out on Cyber Monday, so. Oh, don't forget the shoes that scream unicorn. These are little, here are the little Sue's, I, um, I don't know what they're called, loafers. <laughs> they got like glitter on them. They kind of remind me of an old Truly Me meat outfit Sue, and we'll be back with the outfit on the doll in a minute. And we are back. Totally didn't just mess up something. Here she is in the outfit, and here... So there's the Sue's, which are remarkably difficult to put on at first. They're very hard. Very hard Sue's. And in person, you can see her a mile away. She's very bright. Very, very bright. Here's what the little cert looks like. I can think of a lot of different ways to mix and match this outfit around. There's the little now jacket. The side. <laughs> I'll pan down in a minute. I don't know if the hat's... I think the hat's... Uh, I think it's a little low on her back side of it. We struggled with the pants. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> now it's all weird looking. Uh, here is from the back. Overall, <laughs> overall everything fits how, well. I forgot how, like, weird Sweat. fuzzy stuff makes your butt look bigger. Sweatpants are what they are. The way they made this, it looks so shiny, even though I don't think it's meant to be shiny. It's just, like... I don't know. I guess it is. But it's like that kind of velvet that has that look. and it's, Everything looks like she's going to be spotted from a mile on this. I don't know if it's just me, but did the hoops give her a I'm going to fight someone vibe? <laughs> Gosh. 
She makes fitness look cool. Or not sweaty and awkward. And if you want to add a vibe, this is a weird little bag. It's not included, but it's part of a special uh, limited edition locker set. So it's not an AG item. As you can see by the unicorn charms and the unicorn horn. But the whole point is it matches. It definitely matches the vibe. <laughs> the cat's looking at this tiny thing. Anyway, like, um, what did you guys think of the outfit? I like it a lot. I'm definitely going to mix and match it. Do expect to see different variations of this in the future. Ooh. The shoes were really hard to put on. They were. I will give it four stars for how hard the shoes were hard to put on. <laughs> They're <laughs> so was... hard. The shoes have a learning curve. Sorry about that, Lynn. Learning curve? Yeah, there's a lot of AG shoes like that, though. And this was pretty simple. Like, everything everything else is simple to put on. Even the hat, which fits really well. It was really cute. Hmm. Like, subscribe, comment, and tell me what you think of the outfit. Would you buy it?